Yeah, I think that's a, a misstatement of where most people, first I'm not sure that most people think that's the case. Uh, I think on the other hand, there are serious issues about some governments attempting to control access and more importantly, the free flow of information on the internet. Some of this is done very intentionally, that is, some governments would like to restrict people because they want to restrict speech. Others uh, find that uh, actually have that impact without it necessarily being what they're intending to do. For example, data localization efforts, which are attempts to try to protect people's privacy, are misguided, I think, because it in fact affects adversely poor people and people in the developing world who would be able to have access to the newest technologies, the newest services on the internet, may not be able to do it because of the increased costs from data localization and the like. So I think those are sort of the major issues. I also don't think that companies, by and large, are uh, controlling people's internet access in that way. Uh, I think most companies that I'm familiar with want to get everybody online. They want to be able to provide their services to as many people globally as possible. So I think that there may be a couple of instances where uh, there, there are problems, but I think by and large that's not the real problem.